Okay, hello. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to change the data saved for this game, Tiny Fishing. It's found on Cool Math Games. It's the fifth most popular game. And it plays similar to Cookie Clicker. You just keep fishing, you upgrade your abilities. Like here are the max amount of fishes you can catch, the max depth you can get to, and how much money you earn passively. And so you can click the fish, and then move your mouse around to fish to try and move your hook to fish these guys. They're all worth a certain amount of money. And you can claim more with an ad, of course. And then eventually you'll earn enough money to upgrade one of these. So I can upgrade it, and now I can catch one more fish. And then you just do this again, and again, and again until eventually you are a millionaire by sitting here and fishing. But suppose you do not have... You don't have four hours to sit here and click and upgrade all of these. What if you want them instantly? Well, you can do that by editing the cookies. So cookies are a way for a website to store information about you specifically, like what links you've clicked on, where you went on the website, or information for your game, like here. So Cool Math stores information for this game, like how much money you have, your record, how much of these gems you have, what hooks you've unlocked, and these three levels. So the way you can get to this, I'm using the Firefox browser, but it's a similar process for Chrome and Safari. You can go here, it should say inspect element or inspect. You just right click anywhere off of the game and say inspect. It'll bring up the developer's tools and default to looking at the code for the website, but we are more interested in this storage tab. Here you can see cache storage, your cookies, and we want to go to local storage, and then this first one. Now, depending on the amount of games you've played, you're going to have a lot more of these keys, but scroll down until you find one called Tiny Fishing Cometh Save. This will have all the information about your game. So if I can zoom, I cannot zoom in. These first three, fishing, fishes level, depth level, and earnings per minute level, these correspond with these three. So this would be level one, level one, and level zero, because I've upgraded these two once. We can see level one, level one, zero. Money earned, that's just how much money you have. Actually, I could do this. Money earned, see, 27, I got $27. Gems earned, it's 10, that's the gold you get to buy hooks. Your best score, your record over here, how much you've earned. The hook chosen, which hook you're using. Uh, stuff like, it keeps track whether it's shown you the tutorial of how to cast, how to move your finger, and what the aquarium is. Then some earnings per minute, when your prize, this thing, this treasure chest is gonna happen. And then how much of your fish you've unlocked, and how much have you earned catching those fish. So to edit this, we are going to double click here, and this is now just a string of text. So I'm going to hit the home key to jump to the start, and now I can pick what I want to change. So I'm going to pick to change the amount of money I have. So highlight this 27, and replace it with, say, 10,000. Hit enter to save it, and you see it updated right there. And then we are going to refresh the page. And it may play an ad if you don't have an ad blocker installed. And now, once we claim our money, you can see we have $10,000 and we can spend it however we please. And another way you can change this game is instead of just changing the money, go back to your local storage or cookie. Instead of just changing this money earned, I prefer to change earning per minute. So this is changing what level this upgrade is. So again, double click, hit the home key, and fishing earning per minute level. Let's change this level to 50. And again, like this, refresh your main page. Wait a second. And now we have earned a nice 1.8 billion dollars in five seconds, which we can use to we want. So now, 
you can just play around with this, go back to your local storage, play around with this. You can unlock all of the hooks with these at the end, wherever it says fishing hook 11 unlocked. You can just change this from a 0 to a 1. And this, hit enter, refresh, and this will unlock those fishing hooks over at the left, so you don't have to spend money right here. Now we've unlocked these.